I'm going to give you a better understanding of the timeline track order in Power Director. Let's clear some things up. I have the project for my 5 mistakes new video editors make YouTube tutorial open in Power Director. First, let's talk about the default behaviors of the timeline order. The default timeline order in Power Director is bottom up. What this means is things on the lower tracks appear on top of things on the higher tracks. Things in the lower tracks will appear on the video preview. If we move our playhead to a position on the timeline where we have something underneath something else on the timeline, you'll see here that I have a title under the video track. And as you can see, the title is visible in the preview window. If we move our playhead to another position, here I have a title on track two. I have a clip of a director's chair with the right section masked out underneath the title. Since it's under the title, the director's chair is on top of the title. You can still see the title because the right section of the director's chair clip is masked out. If we left click on that clip of the title, click it in the timeline, move the title over, and then click back in the timeline track, you see that the chair actually covers the title because the chair clip is under the title clip. If I move a video underneath all of these assets, you would no longer see the chair and the title. You can only see the video that I placed under all of them. If I move this video clip to track three, you can't see the title because it's above the clip, but you can see the chair because it's below the clip. If you're finding this video useful, click clack that like button. It gives me an indication that I'm building an audience by creating helpful content for my viewers. If you don't like the way the timeline order works, you can reverse it. Let's go to preferences. Go to editing. And then select reverse timeline track order and click OK. As you can see, everything on my timeline has been reversed. Even the track numbers are reversed. If I go back to some of the other locations I was at earlier, my title is now above my video clip. My director's chair is now above my title. Now you have a top-down timeline at your disposal. If you want to see the five mistakes new video editors make, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to smash my face to subscribe, hit me up with your comments, and drop me a like down below.